lived in harmony with magical beings called Brihes. Their relationship was of mutual benefit. The Brihe protected his human, and the human, in turn, took care of his Brihe. This relationship was known as the Alliance. When humans reached 13 years of age, they would be instructed by a wise man in the art of synchronicity, joining the human and his brihe to reach what was known as the warrior form. This warrior form multiplied the human's qualities and enhanced the magical powers of the brihe in one same being. Warrior forms protected the planet from the dark, and because of them, many monumental tasks around the planet were created. The most powerful warrior forms from different ancient civilizations evolved to become gods and mythological beings, and were part of the Brihe Council, in charge of keeping the Alliance. For thousands of years, it was all perfect, until the day humans stopped believing in magic and dreams, and therefore stopped believing in their brijes. The brijes, forgotten by their humans, were trapped in a parallel dimension. The dark noticed the separation and offered the Brihes to ease their grief if they agreed to become Dark Brihes. A war started out throughout the planet. The Dark Brihis and their followers fought against humans who still believed in their Brihis, trying to obtain the secret of synchronicity. Despite every effort from the Brihes Council and its armies, they gradually lost the battle as less and less humans believed in magic and dreams. After the other, every continent was defeated. America was the last. And this, Emperor Quietemoc, if you want your people to stop suffering, tell us once and for all the secret of the Brihe synchronicity. Tell them the secret they want and stop all this suffering. Tetelepanketsal, do you see me taking a nice warm bath? The only thing that matters to me now is that the secret is safe once and for all.
Finally, the Brihe Council decided to hide the secret of synchronicity in a codex. The Brihe Codex. Restore the Alliance. to me when I come to the museum? I, I think, I think I'm getting sick. Come on, Kimo. It can't be so bad. And besides, knowledge is power. Sure, Otzi. We're gonna get a lot of information from these very <laughs> eloquent rocks. Yeah, yeah, right. Come on. I feel bad for Freddy. Today's his birthday and he has to spend it at the museum. Hey, follow me. Now what, Freddy? This could be the best day of our lives! Oh man, he's going nuts. No, no, listen to me! This museum is full of antiques. There are probably some secret relics protected by the government. You know, like in the movies. If we explore it, we might find the secret. Are you serious? Of course! Yay! Yay! Today's your day, birthday boy. Fun at the museum. Es casualidad, todo tuvo que pasar. Y me en tu interior para hacerse realidad. Nada es casualidad, y aunque te descuento, no de toda realidad, tú eres el constructor. Así es que levántate, arreglate. Feel me, can we wait a moment? told you, here's where they keep the secret objects that not everyone gets to see. Ah. Hey, Freddy, I have a message. Where, in your cell? No, it's Watcho, the watch. It's saying it's only seconds till noon, so considering the exact time of your birth, Happy birthday! <laughs> Alignment has... 
has occurred. Activation has begun. to scare you. It's been a sudden activation. Hey, that rock is talking. Excuse me, but very nice to meet you. I think the teacher's calling us. There is a story you must listen to. Everyone's future depends on it. Here, know your story, chosen ones. You have a heart longing for recognition, and you value friendship. There is also a young lady with a great mind, profound thinking, and sensitivity beyond words. But despite all that, she is strong as a warrior. And the third one is creative. Deep down inside, wants to protect those around him, and his only desire is to eliminate pain. And for these reasons, you are the chosen one. I am Quetzalcoatl, and they are Ra and Chujum. We are the guiding spirits of the Chosen Ones. Everything we've said is part of the great prophecy reuniting us here today. Just at this moment, faraway planets and stars are aligning and indicating that now is the last chance for Earth to defeat the Dark and reestablish the Alliance once and for all. Is that part of the story you want to tell us? That is correct. All right, then we're listening. In the beginning of time, people lived in harmony with magical beings called Brihes. What's going on? The cameo has activated. Finally, after years of study of the occult, searching for an ideal pact with the dark, it has contacted me through my family heritage. A unique piece unlike any other in the world, Garras. Yes, you don't know how much. Yes, we have waited so long for this glorious moment. Here you have it, Garrus, the Kanyo Umbra. A passage to the dimension of the dark. The Brihe Codex has been activated. The prophecy could become true. You must help us to avoid it. The dark will reward you in turn. I have waited all my life for this moment. The one opportunity to fix this world. Nothing else matters. I will do whatever is needed. The dark cannot achieve synchronicity. But now that the dark is stronger than ever, the planets have aligned to allow us to make a complete imitation. What do I have to do? Surrender totally and completely to the dark including your dreams and imagination. In exchange for the power, you will need to provoke the change in you and in others. Hmm, it is a high price. What will happen with my ambitions if I lose the will to follow them through? Tell me. The dark will inspire you and will free your mind. And the power, Elmer. Think of the power. 
will be our chance to beat the Codex. As always, you are full of wisdom, Garras. Very well. May the dark take whatever it wants from me. And defeat the dark. That is why we need your help. And what happens if neither one of us accepts? It'd be your decision, but it will all be over. The dark will continue to grow until there is no way back. Earth and all the life on it will be totally immersed in the shadows forever. It would be the end of the world. We can't let that happen. But we don't have any Briges. They are very close in the spiritual world. And we can show them to you if you are willing to dream and believe. Dream? Believe? <sighs> yes! Meet your Brihe, fearless leader. Hopper, at your service. <laughs> wow, wow, nice to meet you. I'm Freddy. Meet your Brihe, little one. And I want us to be very close. Me too. I'm Atsi. Oops. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Are you oh, okay? No, sure. Don't worry. I'm okay. <laughs> and this is... Glocko? Hey, Kimo, brother. What's up? Long time no see. <laughs> How come they know each other? Huh? Of course. Glocko was my buddy when I was about five. He used to teach me jokes. Yeah, but how? He's a natural dreamer. One, two, three. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're ready. Now tell us how we can help you. You have to find the missing pieces of the Codex to re-establish the Alliance. This is the only opportunity we have to defeat the power of evil forever. Where do we begin looking for those missing pieces that you're talking about? You must begin searching in the past, in the kingdom of an emperor recently crowned, barely capable of lifting his scepter, and whose kingdom is dying. And will you tell us where it is that we have to go? No, I am sorry. All that information will be provided by the Codex. Where do I take you, sir? You just drive. The Dark has three beautiful Dark Briges, ready to help our plans. But, we're still missing the most important. Three kids who will intercept the way of the Brihe Codex. We will guide them, along with you, to be the great destroyers of the world. They are near. I told you, this is my territory. Give me! Hmm. What's up, guys? I thought you were at the museum. We were waiting for you. Look at what I found over there. The same cry baby as always? It's not my fault if he walks every day on the same side of the street I walk on. I think he likes it. How do you see Seiha's beauty? <laughs> That's why I like you, Muty. You're my number one fan. Let's go then. To the museum of the <laughs> I have an offer you won't be able to refuse. Let's move. 
I don't like this. Don't go. I have the solution to all your problems, and I can offer you a brilliant future. Huh? What is this? The entrance to a better world. Need your match. They are fangs. Scales. And claws. You will be part of something very important. You have been crowned as rulers of a kingdom that you have never imagined. What do you say, your highnesses? Do you want to claim your inheritance and have powers that you never imagined? Highnesses? Hi! <laughs> they talk, huh? Can you also speak, Scorpion? Yes, Scorpion, there is a difference. Well? Accept your destinies, highnesses. Kings among men, future of the world! I accept if I can keep the Scorpion. As a matter of fact, it is your Brihe. What about you? It's my chance to get revenge on the world that left my little sister mute. We accept, by all means. Okay, I wonder how this works. Mm. There must be a way to activate this rock. How can the clues be hidden inside this thing? One help. It would help if you had an idea of where we have to go. China. Bless you. What did you say? They had emperors up until a little over a hundred years ago. Why not Japan? That's very easy. It says here that the name China means main kingdom. Therefore, the riddle is solved. The place we have to go to is China, so let's begin by studying the Chinese engravings on this codex. They might reveal something. <gasps> wow, how come you know so much? It says it here. Besides, this is the picture of China's last emperor, Chu Yong. Was probably referring to him. Are we right? Absolutely. You know a lot of things. Thank you. Let's see, how do I write China in here? Mm. Like this, Freddy, let me show you. <gasps> hey, Ma. Uh, China is around, uh, here. Maybe here? Mm -hmm. No, uh, of course, it's here. Mm -mm. Uh, oh. uh, no, no not, not China, of course. China is he, um, he here. <laughs> now what? We have to set the date and place we're going uh, to. The, the date that we're going to? Yes, the codex is like a time machine. It will take us wherever and to whatever time. Could you give us another clue? Impossible. You're doing great. Keep going. Wait, I think I got it. Like Chu Yong said, when China's last emperor was crowned, he hardly had the strength to lift up his scepter. He was two years old. Yes, but the riddle also spoke of a fallen empire. Of course. That is why Puji was China's last emperor. What year do we have to go to? 1908. China, year 1908. Home of the last emperor. Well done. When you arrive, seek the Emperor and ask for his tattoo. A tattoo? What is he saying?
Watch the power of the dark. It knows where the Codex has traveled to. And it opens a way to that time and place. Century, if I'm not mistaken. Let's go. No, Elmer, wait. What is it? You belong completely to the dark. If you cross that threshold, it might not let you come back. I have seen it happen many times. Hmm. I understand. Which one should go, then? indicate that we're not very safe here. We have to be very alert at all times. Oh. Uh, we better go now, right? Why? That guy is giving us a very weird look. <laughs> Intruders! Until we synchronize with you, any power that we may have is very limited. But how limited? so bad in the name of the emperor you three are under arrest huh? us three we're actually six no they can't see us why not because the majority of humans lost their capacity to do it only small children dreamers and people with noble hearts can see us at all times and without any problems it's good to have that information a little bit upset. I'm sorry. Then we'll just execute them. Let it be. <laughs> oh. 
What are those little animals? Stop crying since he got to the palace. And you? Are you able to see our Brijas? I don't know what you're talking about, but I can see the happiness of the young emperor, and you brought it here. You might be sad because it must be real hard to have so much power at only two years of age. It's not that. The little one was taken from his mother to become emperor. Taken away? By force? I'm sorry I didn't introduce myself. My name is Wen Chao Wan, Imperial Nami. I am very grateful to you. Now that you mention it, what do you know about the Emperor's tattoo? A tattoo? But, but the Emperor doesn't have any tattoos. Maybe he has it hidden somewhere. warrior form, but there is a, something very strange. Forms are always visible because humans and Briges join to become one in that moment. a process and a ritual, and it requires some training between human and Brige, and you and I hardly know each other. There's no time! It's now or never! But at least concentrate! It's the only chance! <laughs> to throw him to the other side. Oh well, a miscalculation. 
Calm down right now and surrender. Don't you make us very mad. What happened? Oh my god, that wasn't a good idea at all. What do we do? Did it. It's a Chung Yuan mirror that protects the Emperor. I did it myself. Chu Yun, it's good to see you here. We don't know what we're saving the Emperor from, and we haven't found a tattoo. Can you explain it, Shu Yun? Yes, of course I will. You just saved him. That horrible creature was here to kill the Emperor. I read that the last emperor ruled China for many years. That is true. He grew up thanks to your intervention. We'll think about it later. And the tattoo? Puji was just crowned, so the tattoo has just... Friendship. Each Chinese emperor has been marked with a different symbol. I didn't want a tattoo until I was 18. What will they tell me at home? My parents won't be very happy when they see me with this. Don't worry. The marks already disappeared. What do we do now? It's time you go your way. <laughs> hey, Puji feels alone. Is there something we can do to help him? You already did. Puji, we have to go. Puji, be faithful and you will see your friends again someday. In the meantime, I will introduce you to a friend for life. Oh. 
Let's go. But hurry, you're running out of time. You need to go to the year 1345 before Christ. Don't stop for anything. We can barely hear oh, you. Egypt is too easy. If we press here, here, and here. Freddy, wait. You're not playing in the correct date. You're gonna... I cannot believe those guys dared to hurt my baby sister. The next step is Egypt. We cannot stop now. You boy, prepare yourself. everything for his sister. She is everything for him. She is his only motivation. A long time ago, she was assaulted by a gang. They say they were a lot of people in the street, and Muti asked for help. But no one helped her. She stopped speaking since that day. That's why they accepted the powers you offered. Hmm. How interesting. They want to take revenge on a world filled with cruel people and cowards. What is your motive, boy? Well, I also love her, but I like to do whatever I want to.
<coughs> I think so. But what happened? Where's the codex? He disappeared. I can see the pyramids. There is your answer, Atsy. Maybe that's the way we have to go. You be quiet. Huh? The pyramids are tombs. I don't think it's a good idea to go there. Remember in China? The codex left us near the emperor. You're right. The pyramids are too far away. We have to look for some sort of ruin, a cave or something, but with so much sand, it might be hard to find. Would a big pole work? There are no poles here, Kimo. What about that one over there? That's not a pole. That's an obelisk. It might be what we're searching for. Let's take a look. For sure the obelisk is some sort of antenna from a spaceship filled with great secrets and with... That can't be. The Egyptians didn't have spaceships. Hmm. Look, if we go down that dune, the storm's not that strong. Let's see, let's see. I'll go and find out. Hmm. I think this might be making a reference to the Alliance. And the reason why we are here. It's as if they were telling us a story about the Chosen Ones restoring the Alliance. Look at this! This way! Looks like this is saying something related to us. So now you know how to read Egyptian? The drawings are very clear. Hieroglyphics, ignoramus. Kimo, help me to remove the sand, please. Sure. Huh? What's this? I have no idea. Let me see. Don't discriminate. I want to see. Oh. <laughs> it wasn't me. No, no. Do it again from the other side. No problem. I think it would be better if Kimo did it. Try this side. of him. Oh, God, it's so hot. Oh, it's so hot. You cry like a girl. Please, guys, we're not in kindergarten. There's another door here. This time, let me do it. Nothing's happening. But why? What's wrong is know-it-all. You couldn't do it? Let me try it. 
I don't get Hopper, it. Hopper, help me out. Don't get discouraged. It's just that your faith in me is not enough. But it will come with time. A tunnel. Mm, but it's too narrow for us. But we fit. Let's go. Anubis, guardian of the temple. Are you here to help us? By order of the Emperor Tutankhamun, I have been waiting more than 2,000 years for the Chosen Ones. by leveling itself in the presence of noble beings and the character of the Chosen Ones. But I can see that your hearts are full of conflicts. They've made it after all.
You'll give it to me the easy way? Or the hard way. I won't give you anything. Let's do it the hard way. You will take this rock to Chichen Itza. Yeah, but she tried to protect me, and now she's hurt. Watch out! Get out of here quick. I'll try to hold it as long as I can. Thank you, Anubis. Kids, we have to go now. I've been looking for you through time and space. Ra, it's been so long. My friend. I can rest at last. I'm not barefoot. What is this place? We are in Chichen Itza. If I'm not mistaken, we're on the grounds of a ceremonial ball game. Exactly. <gasps> it's a puckle puck field. A puckle what? Puckle puck. You know, the sacred ball game where they present the great battle between good and evil. This is the court with the greatest level of difficulty because of the height of the rings, built specially for matches between warrior forms. It's the biggest of them all. By the way, I haven't introduced myself. My name is Zompul Balam. Who are you? We're travelers. We come from a faraway place with a very important mission to fulfill. Hmm, and what is your name, girl? <laughs> Hello, my name is Atsi, and they are... Mm -hmm. I'm Freddy, he's Kimo, Kloko, and, uh, where is he? He's up there. Oh, yes, and the curious one is Hopper. We're very important beings where we come from. Oh, yeah? So you must be coming to the Equinox Ceremony. Everyone here is waiting with great joy. It is very special for us. As a matter of fact, the Chosen One just got here before you did. Setsin already helped with the ceremony. Twice a year, Kuku Khan comes down from the stars to give us the energy from the sun. I should be there, but you know those things are boring. I prefer something more exciting, like, uh, poco poc. Wow, I want to meet him. Yes! You already know him, Kimo. He's talking about Quetzalcoatl. The Mayans know him by the name of Kukulkan. Seriously? Is he that famous? Hmm, what's wrong with your Brihe? She's hurt. She tried to protect me from an evil Brihe. Meanwhile, that nasty, awful kid that was with him took the stone that we were looking for. I don't know what to do so Bree can get better. She seems to be poisoned, and there's no antidote in the vicinity to help. Hmm, the only way I could think of to help your friend is synchronizing yourself with it. In the warrior form, it is easy to overcome the effects of the poison. I don't think I can synchronize with Bree. She said I don't have enough faith. Oh, so during this time, it is normal for humans, Vrikas, and warriors to live together. Mm, they are way ahead of us. I found him! I found the boy who stole the stone and he's going to activate it! We have to stop him now! Hmm. So, you are here to stop the ceremony. Of course not! We just need to get the stone! Ah, so maybe you can help us out? I want to become a Cricket Freddy, we have to hurry up! You won't get in the way! I won't let you leave! Oh, he'll 
time to learn to control your warrior forms. I'm sorry, you'll have to stay here forever. Listen, could you take this? What? What's that? What was that, an illusion? What did you do? I just believed that I could recall the beast from Egypt. It was the first thing that came to mind. Are you okay? Yes, don't worry. Stay here and synchronize yourself with Bree. Leave it to us. We'll go get the stone. Give us a lot of trouble. Don't worry, I have everything under control. I'm going to fail you, Bree. Your heart beats faster than mine, and I don't know how to change it. Imagine how our warrior form would be. Kukulkanen making myself present to give her the energy of the sun. Come to me and give me your power! Uh, what's going on, Zetsin? What have we done? This must be the work of the dark! In that case, there is nothing else we can do. The Kingdom of Darkness is getting closer and closer! This can't be happening. The ceremony was supposed to be the opportunity for the Alliance to be restored. that complements the code in which it needs to be used. I see. So that pillar is the piece. Good. Hmm, how 
it was in that pillar somewhere. Wasn't it at the museum? <laughs> With the union of the pieces and the energy of the feathery serpents, no one will stop me! Never! What? <gasps> Mutsy! like it was affected by the dark. It's true, the, the codex is not okay. Look at that energy. It looks like the one in Egypt. Yes, that energy appeared when you tried to program the code. It's true, it was very funny. <gasps> Bree, I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> Don't worry, we have what we came for. We're back to the original plan. Now we only have to activate the codex and restore the eyes. the Alliance, Freddy, the connection between the spiritual and the earthly worlds. This cannot be happening. Elmer, you know there's only one way to get them and stop them. The portal will take us to the kids. You said it was dangerous for me. I have given everything. The price is high, it's true, but there's no other way to stop them. We have to take a chance. <sighs> Let's do it. Ah! Who's that? Where are they? Where? The Alliance has been restored. The true identity of the Chosen Ones has been revealed. A young man willing to risk all and a heart longing for recognition. A young lady with an open mind profound thoughts and a sensitivity beyond words. And a creative youngster whose only wish is to protect the ones he loves and to get rid of pain. You have followed a difficult path and from being helpless you crossed over to fulfill your destiny. No, the chosen ones were supposed to be corrupted! <laughs> There will be no more interruptions in the great plan of the dark. Now you will truly learn what real power is.
I don't know, Watsy. There's something very wrong here. Mm -hmm. Get away from Elmer! What has he done? He has turned completely to the dark! Sometimes the price is too high. This is not a game, dumb kids. Prepare to know the true power of darkness. Where am I? Freddy! Freddy! Freddy, where are we?
to be okay? How could this happen? They were the chosen ones. The price to save the world can be very high for the chosen ones. Well, boy, know that the world will be in her debt forever. She will soon be a legend. I don't care about that. I only want her to be here with me. Brother? I'm okay. <laughs> She's okay. No. She's fine. She's alive. Oh, thank you. Balance has been established. The beginning of a new era. Yay! Hey, you're here. Forgive me. This is yours. Oh. Hey, where am I? Now that will depend on each one of you. If you have faith, you will also discover your Brihe. Casualidad, todo tuvo que pasar. Primero en tu interior para hacerse realidad. Nada es casualidad, y aunque te descuento o no, de toda realidad, tú eres el constructor. Así es que levántate. Yeah. 
Michael Jackson, right? The cosmos is in alignment.